Hi guys, my name is Marlene McCohen and welcome to Parent Tip Tuesday. I have with me today my Harlequin Macaw Rocky who's eating an almond and my mustache parakeet Picasso who's moving from this side to this side probably to fly away and be with Jersey. I know that that's his master plan. He, didn't, he doesn't change sides for no reason. So today I'm going to give you a really simple but great tip, okay guys? So, there's many places to buy bird food from. The pet store, the bird store, that's where I get my bird food from if you're lucky enough to have a bird store around you. Um, and, you know, places like Walmart and Target and stuff like that. I personally prefer, told you so, I per personally prefer um, the food from the bird stores or Petco because I feel like they've got less, um, fake coloring and stuff like that. I don't really like to give my birds that. I notice a difference between those. But this tip is strictly about what to do with the bird food when you bring it home. And that is to freeze it. When you get home, take your bag of bird food and put it in the freezer. The reason for this is because sometimes bird foods it depends on the batch it depends on the season it depends on the store but sometimes you will find little tiny bugs in the bird food or moths and you really really do not want to be giving that to your bird so and by the way i was holding this up but i've never actually seen any bugs or moths in this uh supreme brand so that's something that i should say but um when you get home you put it in the freezer and what this does is it kills all of anything that could possibly live in the bird food because the last thing you want to do is put the bird food in his bowl and then something is crawling around. I've seen two different kinds and remember I've had birds for my whole entire life so the two main things I've always seen, um, I mean the two main things I've only seen is moths and um, these little tiny black bugs and back in the day I used to just like throw the whole thing out I really don't want that in my birds food but um, basically what you do is you freeze it everything will die it won't be able to live in there it will go to the bottom and it's fine I mean you guys know that bugs are in the wild birds are in the wild so that we don't want that in our home so you guys just want to make sure that once you freeze it everything will be great because it's so easy to get a bag of bird food and have a moth infestation really really quick so you want to take care of that um, and by the way if that is a problem there's these little moth traps that sometimes birds bird stores sell and it has like stickiness in them and it'll track the bird, the moths and take care of it right away. So that's it, it's a real simple tip. I hope it helped you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, we love you, subscribe, we love new subscribers. Um, follow us on Instagram and Twitter, that's at Marlene McCoy. My dog's going crazy and so is my bird now. So see you guys, bye.